Did you know what happens when a whale dies? When a whale dies, it doesn't end with silence. It begins with a fall, a journey to a world most of us will never see. A 40-ton body, drifting downward, into darkness. It's called a whale fall, and it's one of the most miraculous events in the deep sea. The body can take hours, or even days, to reach the seafloor. By then, it has crossed entire ecosystems, sunlit waters, twilight zones, and into the abyss. At depths of 1,000 to 4,000 meters, where light never reaches, the whale's body finally comes to rest. It becomes an island of life in a cold, barren desert. Within hours, scavengers arrive, hagfish, sleeper sharks, amphipods. They strip the flesh clean in weeks. Then, bacteria move in, breaking down the oily bones, releasing hydrogen sulfide. What follows is astonishing. A chemosynthetic ecosystem forms, creatures that feed on chemicals, not sunlight. Giant tube worms, zombie worms that bore into bone. Over 400 species can live off a single whale fall. Some may exist nowhere else on Earth. The whale fall can sustain life for 50 to 100 years. Long after the bones are gone, the impact remains. Each stage of decomposition brings new species, feeding and living in cycles, death giving way to life. And here's the wonder, without whale falls, many deep sea creatures might go extinct. That one death feeds an entire world. A single whale's death.